What's up, Basketball Brain fans and members? So you might be asking, what the heck does that clip have to do with basketball? If you don't know, that's from a movie called Field of Dreams. And it's about a guy who builds a baseball diamond out in a cornfield and all these ghost players show up to play. And if you can't hear, the, the field is whispering, if you build it, he will come. If you build it, he will come. Again, what's this have to do with basketball? Well, I get a lot of players who ask me, how do I get in the zone every time I play? How can I force the zone? How can I cause the zone? And we always tell them there's two types of zone. There's the zone that you can cause, which is a zone where the, you're in control of your mind, but your mind isn't completely silent. You're not completely on automatic. That zone, that hyper zone, it takes finesse. It's not something you can force. In fact, the whole point of the zone is that it happens effortlessly, that it's more yin than yang that it arises spontaneously. What you're doing with mental training, what you're doing with all of your, all your physical training, all the shots you shoot, all the pickup games you play, all the film you watch, everything you do to improve, what you're doing is you're building it. You're building it. And if you keep building, the zone will come. If you keep preparing, the zone will come. All you can do is prepare the environment so it makes it likely that you will slip into the second zone, the hyper zone, the zone where you can't miss, you can't make a mistake, where you're one with the game. So you're doing this constantly, and that's why you watch these videos. That's part of building it. You constantly feed your mind with what you want. You're constantly putting in greatness so that greatness will come out. If you build it, the zone will come. You can't force it. You have to prepare it. You're clearing the path for it to show up. You're making a clear way for it to show up. You're getting rid of the obstacles in its way. You're creating a soil in which this, this zone can flower and bloom and you can have that garden. You're creating an atmosphere where that perfect storm of the zone can show up, where you can dominate the competition. There's a lot of analogies, obviously, but I'm using these analogies so you start to understand that the more you let it come to you, you prepare, you work hard in practice, you prepare the field, and then let it happen. Let it happen naturally. That'll get you in the second zone where everything becomes quiet, where the subconscious mind manifests forth and you start to play on automatic pilot. It's a beautiful state to get to. I always show Jordan highlights when I talk about the zone simply because he got in that hyper zone more often than anybody I've ever seen in any sport. And he was, ma he was a master at building it, preparing it, and then allowing it to come. He knew if he built it, the zone would come. This is basketballbrain.com. If you want to get in the zone more often, go try the full program. It's only $27. It really will change your game and change the way you think and the way you play. Basketballbrain.com, we're dedicated to your greatness.